Everyone knows about drones, but do you know there is a person from the Middle East making drones in Shenzhen? Hi guys, please come here, let me show you. Let's go see what they're up to. We were planning to do our first uh, flight test today and we didn't actually expect the rainy weather as you can guys see under like different uh, environment so this is why it's a good opportunity actually to try this drone today in such a weather maybe try our first flight with you guys so who was going to fly this? okay try it again So the weight of the battery actually around 8 kilograms. 8 kilograms. It's super heavy. <sighs> yes. What? Yeah. So with this battery, how long can this flight? So with this battery, actually the drone can fly uh, up to 50 minutes. It takes only around 2 hours to be fully charged. So it has the fast charging ability. We have been trying the drone in the light train. It was doing well. With these kinds of drones that can carry a heavy weight, we need to be much careful. We have just modified this box, as you can see here, to have a temperature control. While or when we do transport uh, medical supplies, like organs or medications or anything like that, because we, we want to keep them uh, cold as they are traveling. Or the weight that can this drone carry of uh, medical supplies is going to be up to 10 kilograms. Uh, while it can go travel up to 25 kilometers radiously. The reason why I became up with this idea because two incidents happened in the same time. First of all, a friend of mine, uh, unfortunately, he died because of the delay of the ambulance because he needed some emergency equipment. And I have also some kind of experience in the drones. I thought about like gathering all these experiences together and to come with a complete solution to, sa to actually save people's lives. So now we are heading to the lab where it all starts. So this is our first prototype, actually, and the only one for now. As I said before, after now the first flight, we need to tune the drone to get the best parameters of it. This is a chart for each uh, or every single motor, how it was flying and how it was like uh, dealing with the fly itself. So now I look at every chart, as you can see here, and try to get the best tuning of it. Every second can be the difference between the life and death of people who are in need in an emergency situation. And this is why Redback is here, to save these people's lives.